Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Fureich, playing as that good old Swede Afrikanische Republik. So, last time, we basically got, we finished off the war against the Soviets, Italy got into the war against the British, and they are not doing very well, but right now, I want to make a few more divisions. I want us to feel pretty good about ourselves. If we want to do this, maybe we could have some special inf. And by special inf, I just mean 40 combat with infantry here. Maybe we can make them. Maybe a few divisions can become these super-powered South African divisions. I think that'd be really cool. Also, we did establish a puppet under us in Africa called Tanzania. Tanzania, I think, or something like that was over here. Tanzania, which they also have claims or cores or core on Tanganyika, which would be awesome if we could do that. And other portions here of Africa that the Italians currently hold. But hopefully not for, of course, too long. And we would like to have an Egyptian puppet as well. So, a couple comments. First of all, yeah, Puppet Master, that's pretty much what it was about. Becoming the Puppet Master of Africa. And secondly, play as Australia someday. In some sort of mod. Sure, yeah, Commonwealth Australia. Australasia, something like that. That sounds like a lot of fun. Play as them sometime. But right now, what I'm thinking. We've kicked out the British from Africa, for the most part. Uh, and, but they're still struggling. Our guys are struggling just a little bit here in the Raj. Oh, American... Philippines. Uh, but the, the... What? America? What, why'd you leave them there? That's, that's disgusting. Regardless. So I'm thinking, you know what? Instead of having subby boys around here, what if we just had subby boys around India and quite literally starve out the British this way? I'm thinking that is a dangerous but effective decision. Because while they don't have a ton of divisions here, and a lot of them are encircled, I would just kill off all their supply. Anything that, anything that moves around here. So our guys are moving around trying to get to their locations, which makes sense. Of course, they were over here, mostly in the Gulf of Gu Guinea. Guinea? I don't know. Something like that. And let's see, can I make anything else? We have industrial priorities. So we'll crack down. 95% already pretty darn good. Probably don't need to do too much about that, but what do we have here, my friends? Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. That's real good. Oh, look at that. Oh, mm, this was a smart decision. Well... For the most part, smart. They still have some destroyers there. So the British are catching on to me. Hopefully the Japanese have a fleet down here too or something. Just keep sinking them. Keep sinking them. But we really got to start thinking. How am I going to invade the UK? No, we don't need that. Uh, here. Oh, Deutsches Reich. Ah, oh, British Bhutan is gone. Give me some of that steel, boys. I need some steel. Uh, lower. Mm, that's good enough, yeah. Mm. Well, yeah, that's good. That's good. Whatever. I don't want to mess with that too much. Nice. Very good. Uh-oh. Nice. Very good. Just make sure they can't spot us too much. Yeah, go ahead and pull out when you can. Awesome. Look at those convoys dying. This will really help out our allies taking out the subcontinent. And then they could probably focus their attention on the cont or continent, the islands, the British Isles. That'd be great. Look at all these small convoys. And they're just dying. Canadian, United Kingdom, Australian. We're sinking them faster than what I know what to do over here. Ah, now this is how we get war score. Or at least destroy their army. Look at that. There's only like one at a time. Convoy. No, convoy. Something over here too. Nice. Just make sure you don't get sunk. That's probably the biggest thing. Ooh. Ah, yeah, I'll take some support equipment. That'd be awesome. Oh, I'm not even training these guys. Get two of these guys at a time. If possible, that would be delightful. And we'll need, need some artillery as well as support equipment to do this, but that's okay. Oh. Ooh, something just happened. I didn't really see what it was. That's okay. Yeah, no. Oh, we got the uh, German Navy here. Nice, part of the fleet. Perhaps those capital ships, they're only heavy cruisers, but hopefully they can do something around here. And is our Admiral... Oh, another ship, yes. Is Guy Halifax learning? Yes, hopefully. Uh, because He's kind of becoming a blue water expert, a fly swatter, and iron side fly swatter, huh? Well, maybe not too much, but he is doing a good job. We got some more fuel. That's great. It's 1944. I suppose I could have produced some bigger ships, but at this point, it's really not worth it. But I guess we could try it anyways, for funsies. Uh, nice. 
Very nice. Oh, yeah, sink all those convoys. That's so good. Look how quickly they're moving in and just destroying Af Africa. The Raj now. Because they're guys, they just can't get any fuel, probably. Or supplies. Or They have terrible infrastructure, too, and organization. Ah, I love it. Very good, very good. Nice. Is that a... Ah, oh, it's an escort ship fleet there. Nice. You can't find my subs, huh? Good, you shouldn't be able to. What's going on here? Some escorts, escorts. Oh, we sunk. We even sunk uh, troop transports or convoys as they were retreating. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh, yeah, we still have a lot of this. Nationalist rally? Sure. It's 0.65 a day. That's not bad. We could get some more war propaganda, but it really doesn't matter. Ignite vulnerable oil fields. Oh. Huh. Well, I don't think we really care about that too much. We're really just waiting for allies to finish this off. For us to train maybe a few more divisions. Uh, you guys are looking great. The Coast Guards? Yeah, you could probably do that. And everyone else here is training, which is great. Um, District Command? Well, there's no one else using this template, so that's fine. I'd, I would have loved to use armor in this campaign, but there's really not much I can do about that now. Um, I suppose I can research armor, but we don't really have the industry. You know, I am building up a few more military factories. Maybe I should build a few more. Uh, I got build one right there. And build one right there. Nice. Uh, do that one. Get some infrastructure in Leopoldville first. Let time go on. This is so good. So we've lost 141,000, the UK's lost over a million, which is great. We have killed off a third of a million of those guys. Not bad, not bad. Mm, they've lost a lot of guys. They've really lost a lot of guys, as well as Australia. Which, actually, the Japanese are, and the Germans are invading the areas close to Australia first, which is good. Now, I would love to see like the stats on the UK Navy, because they could probably just blow my subs out of the water, most likely. And the Raj is gone. Ah, beautiful. Now there's going to be probably a massive invasion of Australia. If not, but planning for the UK up there. Actually, you know what? We should probably research some naval bombers. That would probably be a good idea to do. Hmm. We need more military factories still. But one at a time. One at a time. Can I just buy some? I love buying them so much. Propaganda campaigns. Uh oh. Oh, we're getting... Oh, yeah, I still have my army up here. That's right. I do. Uh, if that's the case... I mean, we could always plan this. This is where we're going to go. But you never know. Scotland. I love Scotland. Wilhelmshaven. Uh, maybe Newcastle. As long as we, like, land somewhere here. And, uh, maybe Hull, perhaps? See about that. And just in case. One, two, three. Y'all come, like, here. That'd be great. That would be great. I don't want to use up any more civilian factories if I don't have to. I could make more civilian factories, but at this point, it's kind of like, eh. They don't need to. Great! There's a few remnants right there. That's awesome. Northern France is getting... has been invaded. I think the Germans should have that, but you know what? That's okay. Just do that for now. So the stats on the UK. They're, con they're very conservative. Uh, they've got a million manpower. They're on service by requirement. Army. God dang, that's a small army. But they're still protected by a massive fleet. No, they got another carrier back. A couple light screens, battle cruisers, battleships. I'm going to need some naval bombers. Oh, boy, oh boy. What do we get finish? Actually, how about Australia? How are they doing? Uh, they've got quite a few planes, a small navy, kind of like mine. Except I have way more subs and they have way more other ships. Cancel the lend lease. We're looking pretty awesome on everything except artillery now, which is great. Really, really great. I keep building more military factories. That's going to be crucial for the war effort. And it looks like we are done kind of policing this area, so we can do that. Uh, actually, how many convoys does the UK have? The fewer convoys they have, the better. They have a lot of manpower invested in their navy, which makes sense. Uh, convoys. Oh, there they are. 
200 to 300 ish. It's not bad. So, they're trying to kill each other off there. We're finding quite literally nothing around here. Kind of waiting for these guys to finish up. Let us pull out of this area then. Come back here, maybe. I might even consider. You know what? It's probably a bad idea. Blockade everything. Uh, get to high, good. That's how we're going to do it. Anything that moves around the UK here, we're going to start raiding. See what happens. Probably wouldn't be good for the Commonwealth of Australia, but that's okay. Uh, nationalize. Yeah, there's really not much we can really do. Are we losing war support? Hmm. Or stability? Hmm. Ah, uh, Supermarine Spitfire. Spiteful. Spiteful. Uh, some better naval bombers, too. Good. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, oh we're still moving through here. What the heck? Capital ship raiders. That's cool. Uh, I guess we do that. That's fine. Whatever. Oh, boy. Eh, we lost the sub immediately, immediately as soon as we come up here. All right, Chili, you are looking pretty interesting. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we lost, yeah, we lost that sub. It is what it is. Honestly, with all this deep sea water, they really shouldn't be able to sink us that well. Their positioning is really bad. Convoys, not bad. All right, Germany, Italy, it's up. Oh. What's going on here? Some convoys. The Germans are trying to raid them as well. Early sh heavy ship hulls. Uh, some of that. We're going to really focus on building battleships, maybe. Maybe a little bit. Just a small little task force. Perhaps. Nationalize emergency production conversion. I really don't need any of this. I really don't. I wish we could change my ministers or something like that, too. A little disappointing, but whatever. Whatever. I wonder. Could we really invade and do well? We might be able to, actually. If that's the case. You know what? We're doing well with convoy raiding. I really enjoy it. But I'm probably going to send my guys to Germany. Repair. And we begin a potential naval invasion against the UK. I think that's where we've got to do our stuffs. Repair, but really just come here. Nice. Very good, very good. Grab some more naval stuff just in case. Heavy ship pulls. Everyone go to Vessel Rams. Oh, we're getting invaded here in Germany. That's interesting. Huh. Yeah, that's a. Uh... Oh boy. Go ahead and pull out of there, guys. That's that's a big navy right there. Nice. No point engaging in there, no worries. Disengage, disengage. That's fine. Chile wants that, that's fine with me. Very good, very good. Everyone's repairing. And then we'll try a small little naval invasion. Great. We're doing great on supplies. You know what? I might even make these guys bigger. We can. That'd be awesome. Go ahead and train. Just a little bit as we try to get more supplies in there. Uh, Serbia, no thanks. No thanks. Anything else here? Nope. So how is Japan doing? They took over all of this. They're still trying to do stuff down here. I'm really waiting for them to do a naval invasion of Australia. Because I don't think they're doing anything else anywhere else. Anything else anywhere else, yeah. Oh, Mexico got Baja California back. When did that happen? As a core... Why'd you give it back? It's a core state. Don't give up stuff like that. No, no, no. Hmm. Oh, they invaded. They have successfully invaded. Japan is doing a great job. The invasion of Australia is underway, which should fall within the next few months. Ooh, what is this? Oh, Selby boys. Can you... Oh, they found the fleet there. If that's the case. Alright, my boys. I want you to do this. Here, here. 
They're docked. Are you repairing? No. They're good to go. It's probably a bad idea. This is probably a terrible idea. We give our guys just a little bit more time to get a few more supplies in there first. They're only at 65% strength. They're stronger than your level 20 combat with division. But it takes just a little bit of time before we can do very much with them. 400 political power. That's insane. Uh, industrial priorities, absolutely. Over two a day. Even with construction engineering on. Good. We're building up some more stuff. I love it. Artillery is looking great. We need to make some naval bombers next. Ooh, let's one of these. That's fine. Let's instead of a military factory, we might be able to do this instead. Get some civilian factories so I can make them even faster. Three. Two. One. Good luck. Let's see what happens. If we can. Um, we need more naval supremacy. Hmm. Well then. What if we did that? Nothing. What if we did this? Now we're going to look for lots of convoys around here. Hmm. They're operating here. Uh, Portu oh, Portugal's joining as their enemy. I was not expecting that whatsoever. Oh, god dang it. Oh, now look at that. That's a giant mess. Uh, well, I'm glad I still have you guys here. Should have been prepared for that. That was my fault. Go ahead and move on down there. That'll be good. Oh. Uh oh. Yeah, don't engage them there. Yep, there goes a Dutch little destroyer. A little Dutchy boy. And these are 40 combat with divisions. Probably not good to use in Africa, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Oh boy. Oh, that's okay. Oh, their organization's getting a little lower. Oh, the Germans. Oh, we lost a battle. Sh oh, we lost a sub. They lost a sub. Their organization's getting lower and lower, which is nice. Portuguese boys going bye bye. Good, they're down right there. Are these guys moving? Hmm. Oh. Yeah, we're going to need a little bit more naval supremacy there. Oh my god, they're just tearing us up. Germany, get some better planes or something. Go, everyone. Go ahead and go home and repair. They're doing okay. All right, we've really got to get some naval bombers. Stop wasting time. Get some naval bombers in there. All right, good, good, good. Supply-wise, we're doing very well. Now we're making some naval bombers. Not very much. Not very much, but it'll be what it'll be. We said we're we have a whole one naval bomber. Spitfire twos. Sure. You guys can probably train as well for now, since you're kind of inexperienced. And they're still trying to enable invade me, like, guys. Well, in the meantime, Australia's going to fall. But you know what? I will resume this with you guys once we are prepared to go to war with the UK, or at least invade them. See you in just a little bit, guys. Alright my friends, we are back and we have invaded the UK. Now, you might ask how I did it. Well, we took a look at the year. It's 1946 now. It's February 1946. It took me that long to try to shred as much of the British Navy as I could by basically baiting them into here with my subs for them to blow them up and to invade me and basically use a couple of naval bombers from time to time. I've got a couple of... Oh, what the heck are you... Is someone training here? Um, yeah, that'd be better. But right now, let's look at the British Navy. I was not able to kill off all the British Navy, but enough of it. Yeah, they still got quite a few ships here. I could kill off enough of that just so we could navally invade the area. Also, I do have a 
these super soldiers that we made earlier on here that I want to send to here. So, I have literally just invaded this part of the country. It's probably not going to go great, to be honest with you. It's probably not going to go great. Go ahead and hold and help you attack because we probably can't pierce tanks. Probably not. I don't think we can. No, we can't. They do have anti-air, which is not good for us. And I'm trying to break out of here, which is, well, it's going okay. I'm trying to cut off Scotland from North Northern England. And we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. Right, cool. Just keep them there for now. We're getting attacked. We're trying to cut off Scotland from Scotland as well. And boom, we did it. Now y'all better hold. I'm going to send you guys up here. Good. And the Germans and the Japanese are flooding in. Australia fl uh, died quite a while ago, actually. Uh, yeah. It's, this is all Japanese now, which is great to see. I have been trying to make another battleship. I haven't even made it yet. But it's... It's definitely trying to come along, and I can't even make it yet. Um, yeah, not much has happened. I lost quite a few subs. I've lost quite a few subs. What are you guys doing? Uh, I need you to train, please. Uh, yeah, we have 15 subs left for this guy. He's... Well, he has blue water expert finally, but hmm, it was definitely a struggle doing that. Definitely a struggle. Would not recommend. Uh, let's go ahead and build up infrastructure here and then some ports. Because that's going to be important to success here. Even though I'm trying to make more military factories, civilian factories. We have, a we have 77 factories in total, my friends. Until we have that other thing, we're going to build even more subs. That'll be good. Trade-wise, we're doing pretty good. Pretty darn good. Let's see any more. Good, good, good. Nice. I've been building up a lot of infrastructure in Africa. That was pretty much my key thing to do. Is it infrastructure? Or was infrastructure? Yeah, they're flooding in here really poorly to the point where we can't really do much about this. We could take that, maybe. Yeah, they've, they're... Oh my god, they're sending so many divisions in. This is going to kill supply off so badly. Uh, We need Edinburgh as well. So we can... Oh, do they have any supply around here? No, they don't, which is good. Hmm, this was a pain in the butt. This was really a pain in the butt, but at least Germany's here and fo can focus on destroying the rest of the army here, which is good, which is very, very good. Take the air bases, too. And I guess the cap for political power is 500. If you didn't know, it's 500, at least in Fjordreich. Ooh, I did want to invade there, didn't I? Yeah, nah. Not looking too bad. We have Aberdeen. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Uh, you might be able to break those tanks, actually, because, well, we could pierce them now, since they don't have enough armor on them. Very good, very good. Oh. Oh, my goodness. I must be... Holy crudderinos. I am out of guns. That's really not good. Hmm. And I'm really out of steel. Oruslan. Thank you. And I'm glad we got allies to give me stuff, so that's good. And we have some more 40 with combat with divisions. Now, since we have military access through Italy, we can do that. And also, we went to war with Portugal, too. They went to... Actually, I think they declared war on Germany, and they navally invaded them through here, which was interesting, but whatever. Um, yeah. It is what it is. Liberia, are you... Oh, you're independent. I think we're going to take you out as well. If I do this, someone's going to take them out eventually, so... Be good. Uh, I want to throw you guys there, but really, just come up there. That'd be fine for now. Alrighty, tighty. Not bad. Supply is pretty bad, though. Other than that, it's not too bad. Cool. If we can, perhaps, do something like that. Send some of you planes, planers, planes. That's really naval bombers. Over here. Do the North Sea. Um, yeah, get out of my area here. I invaded this area. I need to do this. Because they're still going to be blowing up my subbies. And you'll see how bad subs are without any sort of, uh, you know, naval bombers. Because they still have carriers. They still have capital ships. Yep, retreat, retreat, retreat. Sometimes the planes show up. Sometimes they don't, which is really kind of disappointing. Yeah. Oh, buddy boy. That is not looking good. Well, but I did sink two carriers off screen, which is really awesome. Right, let's reform this. You guys. You guys should focus down here, because supplies are already pretty bad. And you guys. Come up here. 
Finish her off this part of Scotland. Especially get a scap of flow. Uh, George, do you have an upgrade? Oh, you're adaptable. I think that's a great thing to be. Piet? Uh oh, let's let time go on, too. No, nothing really interesting. George, he's level 5, whatever. You guys, I've, I've done nothing with this army yet. Coast Guards, not really. Uh, you all... Coos! Coos, good Coos guy. Coos Coos, yes. Uh, oh, we sunk those guys, good. And they're canceling the Lendlease after I have a... Oh, that's a surplus. Now that's a surplus. Yeah, oh, you guys just saw that, that's good. Nice. Very nice. Who can't give me my goodies? Uh, actually, everyone can give me my goodies. I like that. I like it when they give me their goodies. Give me my own goodies. Goodies, goodies, goodies. Nice. <clears throat> so, uh, what was the strategy I pretty much employed while trying to kill off their enemy navy? Just straight up naval bombers constantly. Constant naval bombers, naval strike tactics are pretty good. Uh, we'll do that as well, because we can. Cancelled Lenly, so be it, so be it. We're doing definitely better now that we have uh, some... Oh, well, we lost that guy. That's unfortunate. It looks like they're running out of carrier planes, which is very nice. Very, very nice. I wish someone would try to push down here, maybe? That would be great. I mean, there's a reason why I have you here, guys. Don't make me navally invade again. I do not want to navally invade again. But if I have to, I will. Alright, go and start pushing them out. Oh, look, the Japanese Navy's up here. We lost some subs. Look at that. Nice. Awesome. I'd wish they'd do something, but, you know, okay. Sinking convoys, we're losing planes. Germany, please invade somewhere else. For the love of God, please invade somewhere else. What's this possession is done? I'm going to navally invade down southern England, probably. I mean, oh yeah, Tanzania, I guess, got more territory back in Italy, which looks pretty darn thick under Ramon Chavez. Chavez? What are the Chavez here, huh? Very nice. Come on, Japanese Navy, do something. I lost more ships because you're not doing anything. Probably encircle that group. Probably do okay. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, 1940s cruiser hull. Nice, nice, nice. Keep sinking their little boaties. Yeah, we're going to navy invade some more. We'll probably navy invade hull. Just take some lands around here, or something. Uh, war bonds. I gotta get some war bonds. That's looking pretty good for supply up here. Yeah, we probably don't need that one. Focus on supply down here, though. That's pretty important. This air base, we don't only need one more. Probably, there you go. Lanark. Lanark. Good. Nice. Keep sinking them convoys. That's great. We want to invade whole... We want to invade other areas. The only reason we were able to do this is because I invaded this area. Hmm... They're running out of ships. They still have three carriers, which is really not ideal. But you guys are done, which means maybe perhaps we'll invade Ireland. Perhaps we shall. Let's prepare an invasion of Belfast. Uh, double up on that and come down there to Dublin. Nice. Uh, by the time we're done here, we might be able to do that. I come from Douglas to invade there. This is going to be really risky. Maybe we can get over there. Alright, not bad, not bad. Looking pretty good. So we're going to get a little more naval XP. Maybe get a little bit more research. Uh, yeah. More cruiser hull stuff. Just throw these guys right there. That'd be fine. Just don't die in the water, please. Industrial planning. Better radar. Get even better radar. I don't even have nuclear stuff yet. Hmm. Kind of a problem. A little bit of a problem. But what if we actually built radar up here? It's not a bad idea. I could actually probably help everyone. Hmm. We're going to invade Ireland, then we're going to invade this area, too. So if that's the case, you probably stop doing that and come over here instead. Good. And this is where we're going to be sucking up a lot of enemy convoys, hopefully. Uh, air base. Air base. Get some bombers over here. Oh, that's nice. 400 bombers. 
Come on, deploy faster, please deploy faster. Uh, you guys could probably come there. Yeah, you can still do that. That's fine. Nice, nice, very nice. Good. Blow up everything they have. Give them nothing. Should they have nothing? And once we invade here, I mean, if we can, oh, buddy boy, that's not good. Some occupation laws. Some more support equipment. So be it. So be it. That should be good. Nice. Yeah, it's really pathetic that my allies don't invade the UK at all. Like, it doesn't make any sense. All right, let's see if we can do this. Let's see, man. Power wise, we lost that many guys. They've lost almost three million. They don't have a lot of divisions, and we landed successfully. Great. Take that. Take that. Ireland will be ours. Great. And everyone, come down to Cork and take everything you can. And we'll have Dublin. Awesome. Oh boy. Oh boy. Sinking a few convoys here. Oh, I wanted to go to War Liberia too, huh? Huh. I don't remember that, but okay. Sure. Send you seven. Give me until September 1st. Probably. Ah, oh, another destroyer sound great. And I'm doing. I'm invading Ireland just so that we have more potential naval invasions we can do down in, like, Wales or something. Oh, look, Cork. They're gonna be starving there for quite a while. Good. Anything else here? No. Anything else up top? Nope. Construction engineering is going great. Northern England is well, it's doing they're doing fine. Supplies pretty garbage around here. We're getting more radar, which is awesome. Lenark, we really don't need Lenark then. Let's get some from our military factories, that'd be awesome. Or a military factory. Good. Keep sinking convoys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Keep destroying the destroyers. It's really disappointing that they're not moving. Like, you put all your guys here for what? Nothing. And I attack. And I lose because you guys are doing nothing. I mean, come on. How fair? That's not fair. So be it. I really hope they left these ports undefended. Bristol. I just need at least one area to get into. Uh, I know they have a lot of guys around here. Mm. I really don't want to send you guys here, but we can try it. Waterford. Cool. Oh, look at that. Oh, what's going on? What's going on? Still sinking some convoys. Nice, very nice. Six enemy convoys. Great. Come on, guys. I've given you more than enough opportunities to naval invade. Oh, and they... Okay, good. You're trying to naval invade. That's awesome. Japan, Hirohito, thank you. You actually have a port. That is finally... It took them until July 30th, 1946 to actually navally invade these guys. Japan, you've done the same thing? Good, good, good. If you guys can go, please go. Please, please, please. Now, Japan didn't take a port immediately, but they might. They just might. Oh, look at that. The convoy's gone. Plymouth. Japan, you are having a some sort of attack. Some sort of self-identity attack. Where are you going? Left, right, up, down. Where are you going, man? As I'm trying to navally invade. Go, George. Edwin Brink. Uh oh we need more support equipment. Uh, that's pretty normal for us. Ah, we've landed, but not quite where we want to yet. Good. Actually, someone got that way. Cardiff. Ah, yeah, Militia's not going to win there, yeah. Beautiful. Just beautiful. We've invaded Wales. I love it. Go, go, go. Oh, God. You got cut off over here? Oh, that's not good. I got another port over there, which is nice. The Japanese fully, pretty much have Cornwall now, which is awesome. 
And we're expanding in Wales. I love it. Now, they're reducing soldiers up here, maybe. Maybe not. Ah, cruiser hole that I'll probably never use. I like it. Not love it, but I like it. Light batteries. Cool. That's fine. Whatever. What are we building? Some more stuff. Good. Uh, build it over there. That's fine. Even more civilian factories. Good. We can't quite win yet. Oh my god. These guys are just going to show up and ruin the supply here. Oh my goodness. Guys, just please invade. Please do something. I don't have armor, so... Uh, let you guys do that. Get rid of that area. If needed? We could probably build the... Oh, maybe we can't build the supply there. Build up some supply here, then. There you go. That might work. What happened here? Nice. Alright, so they invaded over here like a Viking would. Good, Norwich. Pretty good, pretty good. Please don't tell me I have to, to invade more. Okay, seriously, they love this completely undefended and the AI isn't doing anything. Ah, <sighs> well, at least we got another port. End of the British Empire, the British Isles have fallen into German hands. The fate of the Commonwealth is unknown, and even the future of our nation is in jeopardy. Our government is divided between British loyalists who want to continue the war against Germany and nativist Afrikaners who see this as a great opportunity to establish ourselves as an independent state. Whichever faction wins this debate will set South Africa down a path that will be remembered for generations. Um, what? What? Loyalists? Uh. What? No. No. No, 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 no. Did they just... Hmm. That piss... What the heck? That's a... That's a bug. That's gotta be a bug in the game. That is not fair. No, 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 no. I'm... <sighs> you know what? That's that's the end of the UK, then. That's that's in my mind. I'm just going to use console commands to annex them. That is not fair. What type of event was that? That makes no sense. But, you know what? Tomorrow, I will have rejoined the Stahl Pact. We will have ended the UK and divided up their lands because... That's completely unfair to me. But anyways, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow when we invade Italy. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.